Hey there. Well, Nick Fuentes has been banned from YouTube, supposedly for hate speech, or at least that's according to YouTube, according to Google. I've been trying to find out what exactly he was actually banned for. You know, what things has he said that are considered hate speech? I didn't follow him. I never even watched a single video of his. I just know that a lot of people are making a big deal about his banning. A lot of people are just trying to say, oh, he was banned because he has conservative views. And I'm like, no, there's that doesn't add up, really. Um, that reminds me of George Bush saying, they hate us for our freedom. Right? So, yeah, that's it's kind of disingenuous. There's There's got to be something that he says that other conservatives aren't saying. I mean, Ben Shapiro says that he can't stand the guy. Ben Shapiro calls him, I think he calls him garbage. You know? But he still is against him being banned. But he still thinks that his views are garbage. You know, there's there's got to be something. And I can't seem to find any any summarization of his views. I mean, there's probably something that could be said in just a couple sentences, maybe even just one sentence, and, and yeah, I'd get it. I look around trying to find out, you know, maybe, maybe he's one of the people who thinks Israel controls the government, you know? There were some grandiose uh, declarations about his views, people trying to say that he's a Holocaust denier. And I saw footage of him denying that. No, he says, no, he's not, he's not a Holocaust denier. So it's not that. I've seen a number of people mention that he has some strong views about immigration. But there's a lot of people who declare their strong views on immigration, who, you know, people who tilt more towards Trump's views, people like, even like, people who are even like, uh, uh, Pat Condell, you know, lots of people pushing those kinds of views. I don't see them getting kicked off the platform. There's got to be something that's been said. And I don't feel like watching a bunch of his 45 minute videos you know, there, there, peop, there's not going to be a table of contents for, for a video like that. You're just supposed to watch the whole thing or just keep hitting L. L goes for, by the way, if you're, you're on a computer, L goes forward 10 seconds, K pauses, and J goes backwards 10 seconds. So I'd have to just continually hit L over and over again until I, I finally hear him say something that's, you know, changes a subject. Yeah, I don't feel like just spending, I don't feel like doing that either. Because sometimes you miss this little, the, the, what's, what's important could be between those 10 seconds, right? And again, I don't just buy into this notion that, oh, it's just because he has conservative views. Because his views are apparently hated by many. But nobody seems to actually be saying what his views are. And it's kind of annoying. So if you know what they are, uh, tell me what they are, please. I'd like to know. Thanks.